Alright, what's going on guys? The Valley of Awesome here. And today, I give you a very, very, very special video. What is this? <gasps> what's in here? Okay, so obviously, if you don't know what it is, it's a Mopar box. Duh. Oh, yeah. But, so I got this from my friend named Cinema Dempsey. He's also a YouTuber. If you guys don't know, he's the one in that yellow Land Rover Discovery Kalahari. And he got this for my birthday, guys. It, he actually gave a present for both Rocky and I. Why is my camera not focusing? It's focusing like a slug. Like a snail. Anyways, you guys want to know what this is? Oh my goodness. Toe hooks. Toe hooks for Rocky. Look at this. This is going to be so cool. I mean, we do have to take off the bumper and all that, but look at that. Oh my goodness, that's going to be so cool, guys. Alright, so it is a bit of a hefty process. We do have to remove the grill, we have to remove the bumper, we have to... Well, I'm going to spray paint it red. Because I, I do like the sort of reminiscence of the Jeep Trailhawks. If you guys don't know what that are. Those are the Jeeps with those red tow hooks and that black vinyl thing on their hood. Except Rocky doesn't have that. But I still do want to paint these red just because I think they'd look super cool. So um, Cinema Dempsey is actually coming over soon and we are gonna go ahead and paint that red. And Russian Bear 001 as well and we're gonna try to get this installed. Right guys, so what basically comes in this Mopar box that I got from JustForJeeps.com is two actual tow hooks themselves, six of these things as well as these retainers and it's a pretty simple setup. Um, I haven't exactly read through the instructions manual yet, but it does look kind of bland. I'm just going to be honest. It doesn't look very detailed to me, just already from seeing it, but we're going to go ahead and try to install it anyways. Um, yeah, my friend should be here anytime soon, and we'll go ahead and get them installed, and these painted red, of course. So Russian Bear 001 and Cinema Dempsey are here. I picked up this can of Satin Poppy Red from Walmart and so before I start doing this I'm going to tell you the reason why um, Jeeps have red tow hooks in the first place it's because uh, well from what I heard is that when Jeep <clears throat> made the Trailhawk versions the tow hooks are red because whenever you go mudding and all that and if your vehicle is caked in mud and you're trying to like you know look for the recovery point and when the tow hooks are red you can spot them more easily and like, for example, if I were just to put these on right now and Rocky went mudding and, you know, you wouldn't be able to see the tow hooks as well. But when they're bright red and, like, annoying, then you can see them. I mean, that's just what I've heard, though. So we're going to go ahead and spray paint all this. We're in a ventilated area, right, guys? Sure. Right. So I don't know anything about painting. I have plastic and cook over. Let's see how this turns out. Okay. Are you telling me that you think it smells good? Well, I'm saying it smells better than white flipping weed or something like that. That's true. It does smell better. There's not much of a comparison. You just, they both smell pretty damn bad. Pretty damn bad, I think. How many coats do you have to do? I don't know. I don't care. <laughs> I'm gonna flip it over soon. Oh, that's good. Three coins. So it's been a couple days since I just installed Rocky's tow hooks. I installed them with my step papa, and it was pretty easy to do. And if you look under here, oh my gosh, they're so nice. 
Like, no joke, they really popped out. And I'm going to go ahead and show a couple of pictures of Rocky when I drove her for the, you know, next couple of days after the install. And so, yeah, um, basically what we had to do was remove the grill, then get under here, remove these two rivets from the wheel fender, or what is it called? Wheel well, this, like these two rivets here. And then, yeah, then the front bumper came off, and then there was another supporting uh, fascia under there, and yeah, it was pretty easy. There's a lot of tutorials online. I don't think I need to make a video on how to do this all, if you guys did want me to make one, just let me know and I'll try to post that. But yeah, these red toe hooks look so nice on Rocky. And they're rated to like 1.5 of her weight. So they'll definitely hold up. They bolt right to the frame of her. So they're very safe to use because of that. They're better than shackles because shackles aren't even... I don't know. They, they just seem more dangerous to me. I like something that's attached directly to the frame. That's a lot better. All right, guys, so, and obviously, you know, she's got red toe hooks thanks to Cinema Dempsey. Now, that was a really awesome birthday gift for her and I. But what in the world is two front recovery hooks without a rear one? <gasps> Glad you asked. Ha <laughs> ha, because um, Russian Bear 001 for his birthday gift to me and Rocky got us this from May, the red Chevy Tracker. Russian Bear 001's tracker to Rocky. So yeah, guys, um, this is a Mopar box from JustForJeeps.com, and <gasps> what is it? What is it? What is it? <laughs> Looks like paper. All right, I'm just gonna. It's gonna take forever to unbox, but what it is is basically a rear tow hook. We're also going to be painting that red. It's gonna be super awesome. Alright guys, so I'm just going to go ahead and install this. Um, like I said, it's fairly easy to do. I don't feel like I need to make a tutorial, but if you guys wanted me to, I can go ahead and make a video of that as well. Just comment in the comment section and I'll try to make a video. Alright guys, so let's go ahead and get to this. <laughs> What's going on guys? Um, sorry for this robe outfit. I, I don't have college today and I'm super lazy because I don't have college. So yeah, um, I just wanted to give you the update. So Rocky now has front and rear toe hooks. It's pretty cool. And so tomorrow we're going to be doing some practice recoveries on the front and rear toe hooks. It's going to be a lot of fun. But I just wanted to give an FYI, the rear toe hook was actually a lot more difficult to install than the front. So if anybody's watching this and they're Hoping to see what it's like to install the rear toe hooks. It's it's a lot more difficult than the front. There's more stuff, more retainers you're dealing with. But yeah, other than that, that's pretty much it for Rocky. Now, if you guys didn't notice, there's another silver vehicle to my left. I guess I never told you guys about uh, that I have a silver Jeep Liberty. And, uh, you guys probably never knew about that, but I'll go ahead and tell her a little bit about you. Why am I talking? Wait. Okay, I'm just gonna shut up before I sound weird. Okay, so obviously Rocky over there. Hello, Rocky. How you doing? And then we have Chelsea. So yeah, uh, her name is Chelsea, but she also has a nickname, and the nickname is Spoon because of that really bright silver grill. She is a Jeep Liberty. She obviously has the second gen facelift, not the KK. Like the KJ also had a second facelift. Our second gen facelift and uh so yeah she is also pretty reliable except she isn't my primary jeep rocky's my primary jeep it's uh actually a family vehicle uh chelsea or spoon is
so she's kind of like our backup vehicle. I don't know if I should make any videos on her. She is quite capable. She, uh, I believe she has the 42 RLE transmission, 3.7 V6 engine with a new Venture 242 transfer case capable of four different uh, transfer case options, such as full-time, part-time, two-wheel drive, and four low range, obviously. Really nice options. But yeah, guys, if you guys didn't know about Rocky's little friend named Chelsea or Spoon, here she is. There's Rocky. All right, guys, so we're going to do the recovery tomorrow. Remember to stay in tune for that because it's going to be pretty fun. We're going to see how the hooks manage to hook, hold up. And yeah. All right, guys, remember to drop a like, leave a comment. If you guys want to learn more about Rocky, definitely subscribe. And it means a lot to me every time I get some more subscribers. And it's kind of the reason why I make these videos. All right, guys, peace out.